Elsewhere, a mother and her child remain unaccounted for after the collapse of a seven-story building in Kahao West here in Nairobi County. The building came down days before it was to be demolished after state agencies condemned it. Here's more from NTV's Nordin Elmog. It looked like a scene from a movie. The tumbling of a building, bustling dust into the air as people ran for their life. This is a real life. It's a building in Kahawa West, Nairobi County, which collapsed Sunday at around midday. Some in the neighborhood stood by with their phones on hand, capturing the dramatic moment as the building slowly scrambled. Nairobi County Governor Johnson Sakaja said household had been evacuated last week following notice by the county planning department. The executive director of the National Construction Authority, Engineer Morris Akecha, said the building had been condemned by the multi-sectoral agency consultative committee who visited the building on Wednesday, 16th October 2024, following which an enforcement order was issued for the immediate evacuation. All the tenants were evacuated from the building, and the building owner was directed to provide a structural integrity report within 14 days. However, before this was done, the building collapsed. By sunset, a multi-agency team was raising against time to resolve the uncertainty surrounding the possibility of people still trapped inside the rubbles. Kwa sasa, tunafocus na kuangalia kama kuna watu wa kukundani, tuatoe, tuakisha wapo sawa, wako safe, na ndiyo tuendele na yokazi ngini. Concerns remain as Kenyans tend to quickly move on from such tragedies, yet many continue living in buildings that are real day traps. Nurdin Almoge, NTV.